So today we've got Mr. Pepper, but I think Medi needs a day off. I think we're working him too hard. I'll have you work just like 11 to 15. You can have Thursday off, actually. How about 11 to 15? And then you can help out. It's like 12 to 18 on the weekends. How about? Yeah, so the afternoon shift. You okay with that? How do you feel about that? So today's your day off. Enjoy. And look, since it's your day off, I can even, even though you're in a terrible mood. Yeah, it's just a nasty combination to work with, I think. Should I spend the money and actually give you skills? I don't know. Maybe I see about replacing Medi with somebody a little more tolerable. Because you're going to be the same issue that I have down the road. It's uh, just short days and also really moody, so it's just a pain in the ass. Constantly, all the time, trying to manage that. I'd kind of like to get rid of both of them. Oh, I like this guy. Dewan Nathan. I shop at stores a lot. <laughs> I use them all the time. Perfect. I'm Dewan. Or Davin. I don't know. Davon. Dewan. I would like to know if you have any job openings at the moment. Dot dot. On a side note, I don't take any nonsense from anyone, and I will always go the extra mile. I can start immediately. Dot dot. <laughs> Jesus. What are you insinuating? Oh my god. Start the interview. Get this guy in now. What are you like? So considering you shop at stores a lot, uh, I assume your skills are trash. Part-timer. Shorter working days, but moody. Higher risk of angering customers. Earn experience quickly and need, need less days off. So you can have just like one or two days off. If they're shorter working days, maybe even just one day off. Hmm. Oh, we still have a point. Oh, you know, I think because it made a noise at last interview, I wonder if I wonder if I am actually leveling. I just don't see my skills anywhere. But I think I leveled up in interviewing or something. Oh, well, if you anger customers, probably restocking, I guess, right? Or I guess register. Can you anger customers with register work? I feel like this would affect just sales and marketing, mostly sales. But if you're a good enough salesman, I wonder if it doesn't even really matter. You know what? I'm interested. You're a basic boy, so 58. Okay, fine. 60. 6337. Okay, I won't tell your wife. You don't have a wife, do you? Hired. Bam. Handled. And, uh... What were you all about? We have no idea. Oh. I do have a bit of an idea. Pessimist and moody. You're just fucking mean. You're dismissed. Get out of here. Michaela Hunter. Marketing. A good bit of it. Because at, at this time I was looking for somebody really basic. To train and mold. She'd be cool if I feel like having marketing going on. Which do I? I don't know. Likes longer working days. Uh, I'm going to keep you on the table for a minute. Maybe. You're a basic marketer. We can give that a shot and see how that goes. And we can see the rest of your stats now, can't we? Workaholic, faster experience, shorter days, and angers customers. But yeah, that's that's you. You only had, you had marketing, apparently. So that just allows them to do that. Specialists in online forums increase the outreach of each forum post. You can also learn a new handy keyboard shortcut on the computer, allowing them to get out of sticky situations. Reduces the risk of having to redo a marketing post. Oh wow. Okay, and then it just happens faster. Hmm. I'd like you for restocking, though. Or register. You know what? Let's go register. Let, let's risk it a little bit. Because I don't think you're going to piss off people while they're already in line. I think that's really more of an anti-salesman type thing. 
That's that's what I'm betting. Hey, we made like three three thousand two hundred seventy eight bucks that day. That's really good. And then storage. Ah, right, yeah, storage area. Up there. Done. Edit facade. Whoa. Ooh la la. Damn. Look how fun this one is. How much do you cost? Ah, too much. Okay. You could also like change where walls and doors are and stuff, right? Do I need to do that? Can I do that? I could, but I don't think I want to. Although, maybe, can I get, like... Does that work? So to get into the break room, they have to come through storage? We'll have to move the storage stuff around a little bit, but... Yeah? And whatever that was, I think it just threw itself into a box over there. We'll try it out. Um, who's working today? All right, Mr. Pepper, for sales, all day. You're gonna have off Friday to get ready for the weekend. You're gonna have off Tuesday, how about? Tuesday, Friday. How's that? You like that? Okay with that. And you're on sales all the time. You're just the sales guy. Okay. So I've got you, and so I gotta quickly restock stuff, which... We ordered, but I need to change minimums a bit. Because I need a few more cans, I think. Wow. Um, order. Yikes. <laughs> Yikes. Start next day. So I can't hugely upgrade our storage solutions right now. Also, I might have to downgrade our register again quick. Do you still sell for full price? Not quite. And the smaller one was 1500 Okay. Let's, let's do that. I'd love to have you, but give me a minute. Bam. Open for customers. We'll leave those boxes out there for a minute. Okay, can't quite afford that yet. Is that enough? Oh my god, only just. Phew! Okay, and then storage units. Uh. Yeah, okay, just, we'll pick up these pallets. Open for business. Give me a minute. Okay, the one. Whatever you say. Uh, just a reminder. You sent me to school. Uh, yeah, right. Look at this efficiency, huh? Man, oh man. Then storage unit. I can see the appeal of having just a little stock person set up just just for a couple hours at the start of the day, just to help out a little bit. Hey, hey I leveled in something. Level. I think I leveled in stocking. Maybe I'm a little quicker with it now. Yeah. And then, sir, these are groceries. Go, 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 go. Yeah, maybe I level up at register one of these days too. Wouldn't that be nice? Takes me forever. You think with like high levels of 
of register skills. You're just like using the homebrew and piping with uh, all your fingers and all that stuff. Just going nuts with it like a robot. So we're not like hunting and searching for buttons to press. I want to see me using a second hand just brrr, brrr, brrr. Oh man, he bought a he bought a lot of things. Okay, getting getting proper cues. Siegfried, he's here to help out with customers. Can you um can you restock for a minute? I'm actually totally fucking busted here. I'm I'm locked down. I need help. There's boxes to unpack. Don't break everything, please. Thanks. There's stuff to put back up on shelves. Whoops. I totally just ripped that out of his hand. He's leaving now. I, I ripped it off the shelf as he was extending out to pick it up, and he just left. <laughs> Sir, I'm sorry it was a misclick. It happens. Uh... Yeah, he's out back unpacking boxes, isn't he? I can tell. He's not out here. Cause I, yeah, he's breaking shit back there. I hear it. I hear him breaking things. I gotta get this display still made. Work sales again, please. I wonder if this negatively affects his mood switching him around all the time. Yeah, too late. Never mind. Go back to restocking. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, I'm. I'm typing the best I can here. I, I'm really miserable with this register. If you saw me play Cart Life ages ago, you know I'm terrible with change. Really seriously, hopelessly bad with change. Hey, can you help me? Uh, what? Why do you guys always ask, like, can you tell me about your assortment? Like, can't you see? Should I get more signage? I suppose I could get more signs. God, is today over yet? We're just hanging on by a thread this whole whole day. Ah, oh, look at that pizza stock. What's happening here? Y'all okay? Yeah, coming. Pathing is a little bit um garbage <laughs> a lot of people getting stuck hey, over there a little help. so is this what you do at the store when the registers are full you just you stand in some random location and start waving your hands is that how this works she's leaving she just shoplifted because uh the register wasn't open <laughs> so many people are getting stuck back here go around the shelf not through the shelf you idiots oh I need a bigger shelf. We need to get a bigger walkway over there. Because they suck at this. Oh my god, we may as well just fast speed this. I'm stuck here all day. Look how unhappy everybody is. Here, work sales. Everybody needs help. They're all very confused. Oh god. She's gone home now. Ugh. Oh, holy shit, I have a moment. Dude, what a day though. We're up to 10,000 bucks. I just looked at that. We are killing it though. I mean, hanging on by a thread and a lot of people are getting upset and leaving. Like, I think 20% of our customers just abandoned because there wasn't anything in stock or the register was too full or they didn't get the help that they wanted. Although if they need help with something and we don't help them, they seem to still just like, they just end their shopping trip then. So it seems like that's a bonus and like a way to get them. Hey, welcome back to work. Where are you? Hey, a don't you work here? Did you just steal something? Okay. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> I think I think that guy works for me, doesn't he? Dude, you didn't want to buy anything, did you? Be real. Wow, yeah, I was stuck here the whole day. So we're at the point now, I need to have somebody on register. I need a bigger register. I sometimes even need a, a uh, second register. 
But let's rebuy this thing. We had gotten our money back before. We'll rebuy that. Hey, have a minute. No, I I actually don't. Actually, I I I, I do in fact. Yep. Yeah. Never mind. Okay. I don't feel like playing the whole, like, what should I buy game with them. It takes too long. <laughs> Power that off and sell it. Get our money back. Quickly shove this over. Plug it in. We're ready. We can have a longer queue with this, which is super nice. And a second one of these would be... Oh, would be pretty Segoy. Yeah. Okay, look here. You want to buy a pizza. Looks promising. Hey, they're learning. A little bit of sweetness with your nice. salt pizza, yeah? A little sad we got rid of salt. It just, uh, it's too cheap. It's too cheap to budget. Not enough people buy it. And even if they do buy it, we don't make a lot of money. It's marked up crazy high, to be fair. But we're making a lot more money now getting rid of the salt. Build a display. Groceries. Pants. Let's go with, uh... What, this diamond stuff, right? I think that's what that is. Seems to be a hot seller. We'll just emphasize it. Or, no, you know what? Toilet paper. The organic toilet paper. Let's do that. Pizza, toilet paper. The winning combo. Ugh. Ugh. When I speed up time, it also speeds up the camera controls. That's bizarre. Oh my god. Dude, what a sweaty day that was. Man. 9,600 bucks we got, and that's after spending thousands throughout the day to uh, quickly get stuff set up in order. So, Dewan is here for what he thinks is marketing, but, plot twist, he's actually here working register the whole day for me. The whole day? Mmm. Eh. Uh, so we can have one of you in the morning and one of you in the afternoon. And then I got registered all day. And then I can fart around making signs, spinning signs, talking to people, pointing at signs. Really a lot about signs. We'll get... Medi, since you're a better registered person, we'll get you 10 to 14. And then for here, like, 8 to 12? Well, 8 to 13. Oops. Oops. There we are. And then the wand can be 14. To whenever, to finish it off. And then from here, like, 13 to 18 on the weekends. So you're both on for a portion of Saturday. Saturday and also Wednesday. But Friday just got 1 a.m. That could be okay too. So I got a work register in the morning. Mr. Pepper's gonna be here the whole day. Like the actual whole day. Um, he seems overly happy, so I'm gonna give you a, a few more hours. You're, you're too happy. <sighs> and I'll have you come in during the morning to help out also then with stocking for a bit. And then weekends you can be 10 to 18 working sales to help out, yeah? Okay, Mr. Pepper, you and I are going places. You're a little bit of an everything. You've got some skills to spend. Uh, restocking risk and then your restocking's maxed out. Reduce risk of breaking articles when they're unpacked. Sold. So sold. And then, yeah, Medi, I'm not sure if I actually want to give you education, because I need still just basic register people. Who aren't assholes. Few courses and customer experience, but no actual experience. Three years at a pet store. Taught cash control in a university. Online. Had your own hardware store. You teach customer service. And for many years you worked at a hardware store. You teach storage systems and you look just like me. Hmm. 
Nobody's super basic, though. All right, fine. I need to reorder stuff. Oops, I always think it's the shopping cart. Minimum storage, 138 things. Bang. It's expensive. And yeah, with just under $7,000 left, we won't be doing any remodeling. Because I got to upgrade, upgrade some storage anyway, and that costs like 5000 or so. It's expensive. It's not cheap. Are we even looking back here? Yeah, okay. Okay. So sell pallet and pallet. And we will buy... Okay, 4000 for these. One of these big bins. Yeah? There. They store four times the amount and only take up a little more than twice the space. So huge efficiency saver. And there is likewise also storage for me, 5,000. They hold three times the amount, but take up like just a little more space, but not a whole lot. But 5,000 bucks. Oof. Oh shit. You can't actually reach that? Uh oh. That's signs. Would like signs at some point. Oh, delivering. Uh oh. Okay. We've got a bit of a shortage of stuff today. We'll see what we're missing. It's like a pallet full of stuff that he didn't deliver. Because we only ordered 126 items. We have 90. Help out with restocking for a minute, please. Mehdi is on a register, although Mehdi is a little bit pissed off already. He only just got... I thought his mood was totally fine. Must have been looking at Mr. Pepper. Okay. You do that. Betty, it's quiet. Take a break. Let's keep that mood high, yeah? Right. We, uh... Do I even need this, honestly? I don't use the damned thing. We don't really have a break room, do we? It looks like a looks like an interview chamber hey. thus far. There you go. Relax a bit. Okay. You can go back to working with customers. Just surrounding this poor lady. <laughs> yeah, pizzas didn't get delivered. thousand bucks to get pizzas delivered. You know what? Actually, the day is still young. We can maybe make our money back. Thanks. Pizzas are a pretty hot seller. Betty, you back? You okay? Where you where you living at? Come on back to work, Betty. Hey, got us thanks. Hey, can you help me? Dude, the pathfinding is like pretty bad. Hey, a little help. I think he's stuck on the table now. Get out of there, Muddy. Okay. Okay, we're good. He's still basically out of mana, but... Coffee machine. Dude, how depressing. <laughs> it's just like an interview chamber. Get this looking a little bit nicer-ish. And then floors. Yeah, that's okay. And then the and then that. Awesome. I kinda like this floor actually. This looks nice. Look how shiny and stuff it is. Wow. 
All right. Delivery. Yeah, 29 pizzas. I don't know if that's $1,000 for the pizza or not. Costs like 20 or 30 to buy a pizza for me, right? So like 80-ish for them. That's worth it, I think. We just have to sell them all, which might happen, honestly. All right, I got to move these shelves too a little bit, don't I? Because it kept getting stuck. I'll move this for now into the corner. How's that? Got a little more room for people? Alternatively, maybe I spin this stuff. Sir, move your ass. Thank you. Yeah. Same deal, but now it's a little bit easier to see the shelves and everything. Kind of, and we can build outward some. Hey. If uh, we want to get this like really cramped. Hey. Hey. Hi. Hi. Spare two seconds. Desperate need the groceries. Perfect. Wow. Yeah, you were. I don't think I've ever seen that just start max. Thank you. And everybody needs help here. Pizza. Thanks. Which takes some serious hey, convincing. Serious convincing is what I do. I'll even have you hype it a little bit for me, yeah? I don't know if I'm hyping it to Thanks. you, or if you hype it to others. Thanks. I kind of assumed that that's hype for their demographic. Like, they tell their friends. They're like, you know, I thought it was garbage, but actually, pineapple pizza is the shit. And they'll be like, yeah, duh, of course it is. What, did you never try it before? Idiot. That's how it goes. Mr. Pepper is gone for the day, meaning we just have a few hours left. I've been stuck at register for a little while now. Money-wise, I think we're definitely profiting. Even with my massive fuck-ups with logistics and everything going on, I think we're still managing okay here. It's all going pretty well, keeping in mind also that we spent kind of all of our money today getting the storage solution upgraded, finally. And we got the new register in. We had upgraded the shelf before. Buying the stock, obviously. Having to express rush order some more stock because I fucked up with the logistics. I think we're doing pretty okay, honestly. And we're not we're not gonna be like a million dollar store anytime soon, but like we're we're getting there at least. Should also note that toilet paper is selling pretty quickly, the organic stuff, because that's what's in the window. My god, look at the cute wrap around. Wow. Oh, the window stuff really sells. They they definitely prioritize that a lot. We should probably have something that we can stock more of in the window. So maybe I do go with one of those canned things like the uh I don't know, maybe even that like organic uh just mixed veg stuff, even. Because that was also a pretty good high price. It's also not really selling at all whatsoever. This this stuff is selling like hotcakes, man. That's selling about as well as pizza is. Which is a pretty fine achievement, really. Hey. I think I'll I think I'll do that, because yeah, I can't I can't keep restocking that stuff so quickly. But we only hold six on a shelf. But this stuff I hold potentially a lot more. Serious convincing. Okay, well look. I'm gonna try it. This is gonna be a, a new hot item here. The mixed veg stuff. Tell your friends. 